animals. The weather affects them just the same, and right now it's a race against the clock for local farmers who are preparing to keep their livestock safe ahead of this storm. News 3's Paul Wilcoxon talked to one farmer to find out how. Caring for the animals is hard anyway, but when we have weather like this, it just makes the job more difficult. Farmers in the Midwest have faced winter weather for generations. We're no different than any other farmers here in Southern Illinois or anywhere. They're preparing just like we are. With the first winter storm of the season set to hit on Thursday, farmers are preparing for what's to come. Our first priority is to making sure that they have water and making sure that our waters don't freeze up. One key element is making sure all the animals have shelter to escape the cold weather. If the animals get wet and cold, that's bad. So we want to keep them dry and have some bedding for them so they can uh, so they can uh, stay warm. With wind chills factors expected to dip down near negative 20 degrees, having plenty of food is essential. Helping to keep those cattle safe during the winter storm is Chris Vick. He's the director of University Farms. He says livestock's food intake will almost double during this time. In cold weather, um, they consume a lot more food, so we want to make sure that there's plenty of feed. We're going to put out probably twice as much hay. And, 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 and just to be sure, we're just going to put out extra and just make sure that they never run out. Workers at SIU Farm Service Center have spent the last three days making sure all the heaters on their water tanks are working. Being prepared also means making sure all the equipment is working correctly. That's why the farm has prepared for winter for a few weeks now. We didn't want to start preparing right before the storm comes because, say, we have electrical problems with our heaters. Well, physical plant needs time to come out and repair those heaters. About 100 cows roam the field at the Farm Service Center. And just like most people don't want to stand out when it's cold, Vic says neither do cows. They, they, they're going to stand out in the in minus 20 degree wind chills. Reporting in Carbondale, Paul Wilcoxon, News 3.